with their lips they do honor me. Because in the, in the church where they say, I love the Lord. I love the Lord. They said, but their lips they do honor me. But the Lord ain't looking for uh, lip service. He's looking for actions. Read on. But have removed their heart far from me. See, your heart means your mind has removed our mind from the Lord. What's that, what's that to keep the law? Leviticus 20 and 13. Cause this is the thing right here. We 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 can, we come here to correct our community. That, that vibration on you is not of the Lord. You do got a vibration on you. It's clearly we clearly can see it. And we and we we're here to bring you out of that sin that you in. Give me that. This this is the judgment on that. Read that. The book of Leviticus, chapter 20 and verse 13. If a man also lie with mankind as he lies with a woman, both of them have the, 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 the one that's given and the one that's received. Read. Both of them have committed an abomination. The Lord said that's an abomination. Read. They shall surely be put to death. They, they shall what? Put to death. God's going to put our people to death in, in any type of sin. Give me Romans 1 and 25. So we are here to correct you, my brother. We ain't here to bash you. We can try to get that spirit off you. Who you learned that from? Your oppressor. You learned that from your oppressor. You do have an oppressor. Your, what, hey, ain't these your people? Ain't these your people? The only person that can save us is not you. Oh my not you. Not you. Not Give me that. you. But the book of Romans, chapter 1 and verse 25. Who changed the truth of God into a lie? The scripture says, who changed the truth of God into a lie? Read. And worship and serve the creature more than the creator. And I can see it's you. You, you don't even think you have an oppressor. Who is the creator? Your, your oppressor set these churches up in the, in the communities. Read on. Who is blessed forever. Amen. For this cause, God gave unto them unto vile affection. It's saying unto, God has given unto them vile affection. It's a vile affection for a man to have a, to act like a woman. Hold on, hold on. I want you to see this too. Because this is a problem that's plaguing our community. No, we pass no damn microphone. This is all for him. Hey, hey, keep back, back up though. Back up though. Come on. Hey, come on. Back up. No, no, we ain't judging. We're trying to bring you out of that sin that you in. Read. For this cause, God gave unto them up unto vile affections. That God has gave to our people vile affection. Read. For even their women did change the natural use into that which is against nature. He good. He good. He all right. Read, 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 read that part again. For this cause, God gave them up unto vile affections. That's a vile affection on you, bro. That's a vile affection on you, bro. Read. For no, no, we're giving you love. We're giving you love. No, you Try to show you the error that you in. Read. For even the women did change the natural use into that which is against nature. It's a, yeah, it's a natural use of a woman to have children. It's a, it's a natural use of a man to impregnate that woman. Read. And likewise, also the men, leaving the natural use of the woman, Burning their lust. That's what's going on with this brother. He's burning in his lust. That's, that's evil. They, that, that didn't come from us as a people. We got that from our oppressors, the so-called white man, the so-called African man, all the other nations. That's who we got that from. Read. Burning their lust one towards another. Burning their lust one towards another. That, that's wicked as hell. Read. Men with men, working which is unseemly. That's unseemly. A man and a man laying together. That's unseemly. That's disgusting. Read. And receiving in themselves that recompense. They're going to get a recompense. The Lord said he's going to get a recompense. They're going to get payback for that thing. Read. Of the era which was me. He said they're going to get a recompense. They're going to get corrected. They're going to get put to death for that if they don't change. And the Lord and the Lord said that's meek. I mean, it's good. What's your, what's your question, brother? What's your question? Give me the room 2861. Hey, what's your name, sis? What's your name, bro? Daniel. And what's your name? Tony. You said Tony? Okay. You just said, they said that's why God gave him all type of diseases. Watch this. Read that. The book of Deuteronomy, chapter 28 and verse 61. Also, every sickness. Every what? Every sickness uh -huh. and every plague, which is not written in the book of this law. It's AIDS 
in the Bible? Is cancer in the Bible? No. It says, which is not written in the in the book of this law. Mm hmm Watch this. Read from the top again. Also, every sickness and every plague, which is not written in the book of this law, then will the Lord bring upon thee until thou be destroyed. So all uh, people, who, who leads, and when you look at it statistically, who leads in gonorrhea, HIV, AIDS? Who, who leads in that statistically? Us, all, us as a people. Why? Because we are the people of God. That were given his law, statutes, and commandments. Right. When we break, when we break them, then the judgment falls on us. We're gonna get punished. He ain't worried about the other nation. Y'all have some type of understanding. I see she got a head covered, she got a, she got a dress on, right? They been to the school? You watch your line? All praises. All praises. Watch your line. Okay, y'all plan on making it to the school? Okay, all praises. We're trying to get we trying to get them two to the school. Tony. Tony and Daniel and Cortesia. Hey, bro, what's your name? Mario. Mario, so you, you uh, have you heard this before? Mm, not really. Not really. Not in person. No. Nah, but you, person. you 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 know about it though. A little bit. About the twelve tribes. Nah. You don't know about the twelve tribes. Nah. Oh, you just heard Jesus was black. Oh, you just found out since. Oh, praise. <laughs> yeah, give me that. How about God? God is black too. Y'all know that. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? No, no, this, this is so-called Jesus. And, and according to the Bible, according to the Bible, Jesus is the black man, right? But the, the heavenly father, the creator, who we, who none of us ever seen. Y'all know we never dealt with the, the father. We've always been dealing with Christ. When, when, when you deal with like Moses in the burning bush, that was Christ. When, when, when we dealt with, in the beginning, that was always Christ. We've never... We've never dealt with the, the Heavenly Father. It's always been Christ. Give me that nine in Isaiah 9 and 6. Because that God, that God that we always dealt with has always been Christ. Watch this. Chapter 9 and verse 6. For unto us a child is born. But Christ, that God that we always dealt with, he came on earth. He was born. Read. Unto us a son is given, uh -huh. and the government. <laughs> so what government? Because that's what we do in our hell. We raising up a, a government. God's government is coming to earth, and it's gonna be it's gonna be a, a rule by this Bible right here. Read. And the government shall be upon his shoulder, uh -huh. and his name shall be called Wonderful, uh -huh. Counselor, uh -huh. the Mighty God. The Mighty what? The Mighty God. The Mighty God that we always been dealing with is talking about Christ. Read. The everlasting father. He's the ever and he's the everlasting father. That's who we've been dealing with. All this time, we never dealt with the most high. But in the future, when the, when, the, when Christ comes back to save us, he's going to say, he, that's when we're going to meet the heavenly father. When, when all sin is real, when Christ comes back to take down these nations he, from the rule, then he's going to, we're going to clean up all sin on this earth. All right, read on. The prince of peace. The prince of peace, because all peace is going to be on earth. And there ain't gonna be no weapons being, being being made on earth. Give me that. Go get, go back to Deuteronomy 28. Let's start with 15. So we're gonna show according to the Bible who, who we are according to the Bible. And did we, we didn't read uh, Psalm 147. Let's get that. So this is a point I was making right here. When we uh, those diseases and everything, like the brother in homosexuality, like diseases that come from the, those type of things. This is why. Read that. Psalms chapter 147, verse 19. He showed this word unto Jacob. He said, show his word, the Bible, to Jacob. His statutes and his judgments unto Israel. So Jacob is another name for Israel. Okay, read. His name was changed in uh, Genesis 32 and 28. His name was changed to uh, Israel from Jacob. Read on. He have not dealt so. Yeah, what? He have not dealt so with any nation. So he said, he, the other nations don't, God don't deal with them. Because he said he had not dealt so with any nation. Read. And as for his judgments. As for his judgment. They have not known them. They don't know the, the judgments. They don't know the law. And they don't know the judgment for breaking the law. So how can God hold the other nations responsible? If the Bible just said that. They don't know the judge and the laws and the judgment for breaking the law. You think he going to hold them responsible for that? You see what I'm saying? But if he gave it to his particular people, you know, 
you're responsible for it. Right. You, see, you, you see what I'm saying? So, see, so, so, just get that, uh, 1 John 3 and 4. So, let me, let me show y'all something what's going on that y'all not privy of, that you don't know about, but the other nations know. When they brought us over here, they had a plan on how they was going to continue to rule over us. They, they, you know, they knew this from the beginning. They came up with it because why? They were dealing with the Satan himself. When the Lord created Satan, it's to go against, it's to go against him. Satan don't do things outside of the Lord, what the Lord telling him to do. That's what we have to realize. And he controls the people. So when he controlled these nations, when they came and got us, the Lord's behind that. Oh, read that. First John chapter three and verse four. Whoso committeth sin, transgresseth also the law. Uh -huh. For sin is the transgression of the law. Says, for sin is the transgression of the law. Who were the laws given to? The Israelites. You heard that, bro? The laws were given to the Israelites. So if the laws were given to the Israelites, the other nations outside of Israelites weren't given the law, can God hold them accountable for it? If he hadn't given it, he never gave it to them. He, he, uh, but the Israelites he can hold liable. But the other nations, he can't. Exactly. So, the Bible just said that sin is the breaking of the laws. He didn't give them the laws. The other nations didn't get the laws. So, who can sin? Now, watch this. Read that, read that part again. Whosoever committeth sin, transgresseth also the law. For sin is the transgression of the law. Transgression means the breaking of God's laws. When we, when we read it, said for his laws and his, and his judgments, they don't know them, right? So if, he, if they don't know the laws, if they weren't given the laws, how can they sin? You see what I'm saying? My point is, you can sin. The Israelites can sin. But... They weren't giving the law to sin. Because the only thing it means is breaking of the laws. You see what I'm saying? They weren't giving the laws, so God's not holding them accountable for breaking the law. So they can't sin. But you can. Right. You can. So that now you see why like they push the homosexuality in our communities. Why they pushing the pork, shrimp, crab, and lobster in our community. That's a sin. To eat pork, shrimp, crab, and lobster. All those things that uh, in the bottom of the sea, catfish. The Bible gets let's get the, uh, let's get that the 11 and 11 7. The dietary law, cause that's a sin. That that got us over here in captivity. You understand? That's why we over here because we broke God's laws. Right. So in order to fix us, we're gonna have to come back to His law. Read that. Right. The Book of Leviticus, chapter eleven and verse seven. And the swine, uh -huh. though he divide the hoof and be cloven footed, yet he cheweth not the cud. He is unclean to you. He is unclean to you. He said, the swine, the pork is unclean to us. Jump up to verse 1. Verse 1. And the Lord spake unto Moses and to Aaron, saying unto them, Speak unto the children of Israel. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Read that from the top again. Speak unto the children of Israel. Say, Speak unto who? The children of Israel, uh -huh. saying, These are the beasts which ye shall eat among all the beasts that are on the earth. Who are you speaking to? Speaking to the children of Israel. When you, when you go from the, from the beginning to the end of this book, it's the Lord speaking unto the children of Israel. Now try to verse 7. Verse 7. And the swine, though he divide the hoof and be cloven-footed, yet he cheweth not the cud, he is unclean to you. Who is to you? Right. He is unclean to you. Cause what, what what say it again? Can't fit, it clean exactly. See the Lord when the Lord made these animals and stuff, he made, he had purposes for them. He had reasons that he made them. You know what I mean? It ain't, it wasn't for you to eat it. But who we got that from? Who we got that from? Right. Our enemies. Give me Isaiah uh, twenty nine thirteen. In the book of Isaiah 29, 13, it speaks about how we've been brought up under our oppressor and we learn his ways. Read that. Isaiah chapter 29, verse 13. Wherefore the Lord said, for as much as this people draw near me with their mouth. Remember I said who this book was speaking about, speaking to, is still speaking to you. This is scripture right here. Read it from the top again. Wherefore the Lord said, 
For as much as this people draw near me with their mouth uh -huh. and with their lips do honor me. With their lips they do honor me. Because in the, in the church where they say, I love the Lord. I love the Lord. They say, but their lips they do honor me. But the Lord ain't looking for uh, lip service. He's looking for actions. Read on. But have removed their heart far from me. We say your heart means your mind. Has removed our mind from the Lord. What's, what's that? To keep the laws. Read. And their fear toward me is taught by the precept of men. What's the precept of men? Meaning the laws of men. Who are the men that taught uh, us God? Who taught us God? Do we have it on here? So we can read. We can we can read it right. So you know they had us on auction blocks. Yeah. Who taught? Who taught? Who taught us? Uh, who taught us the Lord? Because and when they taught us the Lord, they taught they taught us this too. That, that came with it too. You know what I mean? But when you read the Bible, say he's a black man. And that's his name, Caesar Borgia. He's he's the son of uh, Pope. Alexander the Sixth of Rome is a homosexual. Yeah, misleading. But you know what? Why they got to do that though? Why? They, why they got to mislead you? You think they, you think they going to teach you that you uh, you a child of God? They can't do that. They can't teach you that you're a child of God that you must keep God's laws. Right. Give me uh, Sirach twenty four and, and twenty three. Watch this. Uh, these these they they try to keep you out of this book. They try to keep you, they keep us as a people. It means you keeping the laws. It all goes back to the laws of God. Read that. Sirach chapter 24, verse 23. All these things are the book of the covenant of the Most High God. Uh -huh. Even the law which Moses commanded for inheritance unto the congregations of Jacob. The congregation, man, we read about Jacob, which is Israel. Our heritage is this Bible, the keeping of God's laws. Because what comes with the laws? You have feast days. You have a dress code. You have moral laws. You have civil laws. How we deal with each other. Give me that in Leviticus 19 17. So we, how we deal with each other as a people, those are laws of God. We don't, we don't, we don't we'll be killing each other. And like how, and really, like, like the, the homosexual that just left, that was love we was giving him. Right. Cause they, they ain't how we roll as a people. Exactly. Yeah, but of course, give me uh seven and eleven of uh I think it's Zechariah. Zechariah chapter seven and verse eleven. This, this is the Bible. Prop. This is the Bible speaking about our people. Watch this. But they refuse to hearken. And they, they refuse to listen to the laws of God. And pulled away the shoulder. And they, and they pulled away their shoulder. How, how, how? Like you? Like you? Hey, come here. It's like yo, yeah. man. Read on. And stopped their ear. I mean, they stopped their ear. I mean, like, they don't want to hear. They close their ear. They put their hand over their ear so they don't hear. Read. That they should not hear. Yea, they made their hearts as an adamant stone. They made their mind as an adamant stone. Man, they don't want to hear nothing that we come out the Bible with. Read. Lest they should hear the law. Lest they, before they hear the law, they, that's, that's, those are things they do before they hear the law. They don't want to hear it. They stop their their ears, they pull away the shoulder. They said, less, meaning before they hear the law. Read. And the words which the Lord of hosts have sent in his spirit. They said, and the words which the Lord has sent in his spirit. This is the Lord's spirit. He left this book for us. Read. By the form of prophets, therefore came a great wrath from the Lord of hosts. So that's what's coming. Great wrath is coming to, 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 the, to America. And our people that don't, that don't hearken to the word of the Lord. Right. Nation is family. Nation is community. Nation is men leading by example. Nation is women's support. Nation is children with role models. Nation is unity. Nation is you.